my little maple tree is gonna make it guys so uh during transplant it went into major shock um you can see up there i'm too short to reach up there but the leaves were they were crispy and you know they just started dying and so i came out here and babied it mulched we got our worm farm so put some worms down in there some of the worm uh, mulch they made and now look got new growth coming back like crazy already it's awesome this tree is going to be great it's going to do just fine my apricot tree uh, which is why i said apricot earlier instead of avocado so it's peeling and i had to do some research about that and it's actually growing out of its old skin so just getting taller um going through shock a little bit right now from transplant we got more apricot and pears this one's a pear coming um so this one's going through shock i'll use all that for mulch the trees leaves help it um i'll, I'll have to come out and baby this one too and you know trim back some stuff and get her going like we did the maple so down here we're gonna be doing um like a tiny little earth ship down there we got so many tires junk tires that were left on the property uh, before we bought it and cut a lot in half um, and this whole thing is gonna be the tire wall cut a lot in half spray painted um, this is going to be corn, it's, we got corn going, and carrots, more peppers. We got the chicken coop here. Our chickens are in. We're just waiting to get them from our farmer friend in town. So let me walk you over to the fire pit. Still not completely done with the floor. We got more flat rocks to collect. And then we'll stamp them down and uh, put some sealer on. But yeah, it's it's uh, pretty awesome. All these rocks came from our property or um, other states we've traveled. This will be um, an outside oven once we get the, the grates in. We'll build more rock. It'll be like a, a rock oven. We gotta, I gotta come out here and redo my letters live laugh and love and then before we seal them down but this is really easy to do guys this is super simple super cheap um you just get your your post there and then you're gonna screw wire you see crisscrossed and then you just you gotta hand place each rock so then we'll get our patio furniture and all that out here we'll probably throw a um gazebo type thing over the top really high so and then uh, he just cleared out the area there where we're gonna build probably a straw house uh, do some research on that it's pretty cool we'll be doing videos on that as we build too we are waiting on uh, Fran to come out and see our progress so thanks guys new beginnings so Rachel made me um, separate from the our friends garden the tomato slice that I had eight tomatoes growing she made me separate them all she said I had to do it before things got crazy so I did I separated them all Rachel there you go happy love you and one more thing um, so I planted my berry bush. It's not a raspberry. It's um, a type of native blackberry. And these kind, they grow up. Vine. They're vining berries. So got that in. Got our worm farm mulch in. And then we mulched the top with sawdust. And uh, he just went to get some wood chips that we have everywhere else. 
So uh, there we have it. I'll be doing some um, this and the black is supposed to be like this because the berries are super black. So yeah, progress at the homestead is from motivation. <laughs> Say hi! Say hi! Hi, everybody. See you next time. Bye. Mwah.